How is it going, ladies and gentlemen? I've got another quick daisy video for you today. This time, we're going to look at the combination lock on your bases. Yes, you can lock your bases with the combination lock. And I found this one in a shed. I've seen them in houses as well, specifically the single story yellow house with the kitchen and bedroom. Once you've found your combination lock and you've built your fence and gate and decide, I want to keep some intruders at bay, you need to look at the side of the gate where your combination lock attaches. You will get the option to dial in your code, your three digit code. This took me a while. It's a little bit finicky. In my opinion, it could do with being on mouse wheel controls and A and D to choose which number you want to do and then scroll wheel to select that number and then maybe press F to attach it to the gate. Probably be a little bit quicker because at the moment it's a little bit hard and a long process to unlock that gate or lock it again if danger comes a knocking. Also, it can be a bit difficult to find where the actual option is to unlock as well. It took us a while and at one point somebody was locked inside the base. Sorry, smoking. But at least we know it works. It just needs a bit of fine tuning and tweaking. That's not going to stop people getting in your base, though. Make sure you've got barbed wire around the edges. That will eventually stop them climbing. When climbing and vaulting is part of DayZ in the future, it's going to be a whole different ball game, and you're going to need even more defenses for your base. Oh, and you may also notice some new animations to do with base building. No spoilers. I hope this quick video on locking your base with the combination lock has helped you guys out. Stay safe out there, and I'll see you peeps next time.